There's a spot out in space where gravity just chills out. We always think gravity is either pulling you in or letting you float away, like it's an on-off switch. It's not. Gravity never stops pulling. But there are places where two big poles balance each other out. Space doesn't push or pull too much. It just holds you there. These are called Lagrange points. Picture this. You're standing between two giant fans blowing straight at each other. If you step closer to one, it pushes you back. If you step the other way, the other one does. But if you stand in the perfect middle, the wind hits you from both sides and cancels out. You're not flying anywhere. That's exactly what happens at a Lagrange point. The sun pulls one way, the earth pulls the other. A spacecraft can park right in the middle and just stay there. Here's the simple version. The earth tugs, the sun tugs back. A small spacecraft slides into a sweet spot where those tugs even out. And since the earth is moving around the sun, these points move with it. So when a spacecraft parks there, it basically rides along with earth. There are five of these parking spots. Scientists call them L1 to L5. L1 is between Earth and the Sun. L2 is behind Earth. L3 hides on the far side of the Sun. L4 and L5 make a triangle shape with Earth and the Sun. L1 and L2 are a little wobbly. It's like trying to balance a ball on top of a hill. You can do it, but you have to nudge it now and then. L4 and L5 are different. They're like a ball resting in a bowl. If it moves a bit, it rolls back. Super stable. Spacecraft love these spots because they save fuel and give great views. At L1, you can stare at the sun 24-7. That's why Solar and Heliospheric Observatory hangs out there. At L2, you get a clean, quiet view of space with no Earth or sun in the way. That's why James Webb Space Telescope lives there. L4 and L5 are empty for now, but they'd make solid future parking spots for stations or depots. Because these points balance things out, a spacecraft doesn't need to fire engines all the time. It's like parking your car on level ground instead of a hill. Less effort, less fuel. This isn't some far off idea. We already use these points every day. They watch the sun, warn us about solar flares, and help us look deep into the universe. And in the future, these little calm spots could be home to space stations, fuel stops, maybe even factories.